Wait, what day is it? Oh, day 48 of documenting my life because every day is special. Happy Friday! We have made it through the week. I just had my eight, not not 8 a.m. 9 a.m. MT class where we finished doing the song I Feel Must So Much Spring. I'm back in my dorm for a little bit and I am drinking a tiny little tomato soup that Angelina gave me to try. Um, it's like a little just my, you microwave it for like a minute and it's perfect. It's so tasty. And it's just like this tiny little cup. Um, and yeah, I, my tap class was canceled today, so I have a little more time to just relax. And so, I mean, I'm done for the day school-wise, but I will be heading over to um, Arlington tonight and you know, enjoying some time with good friends. I also forgot to mention that I have a podcast today. I almost forgot because I've been like going through this crazy week, but I just talked to Jello, and so we're still on. We're going to push it to one, but it is happening. So I got to get ready. I got to finish up all of this document stuff, get my makeup done, do my hair, and, you know, get ready for another great day. I am back in the practice rooms that are located in a basement to do my podcast with Angelo Soriano, known as Jello, DJ Jello. Um, and he was a swing in Here Lies Love. And he also just did like so much work for the show in terms of social media. Um, he made beautiful videos about the show and of the songs and people making like jazzier covers or pop rock covers of the songs. It was all just really cool. And Jello is one of the nicest people I know. And so I cannot wait to chat with him for a little bit and just ask him all about what it was like at the time of doing Here Lies Love. So this is my setup for today. I've got iPad with questions, computer with the Zoom, water in case I get thirsty, Here Lies Love playbill to hold for the like little cover picture, my case for my camera oh that i'm holding right now and backpack jacket all this stuff um but we are ready for the podcast and i haven't done one in a little bit in a couple weeks i think so i'm super excited to get back to it because <laughs> you know there'd be a lot of karaoke parties in the house and she of course wanted to show off her uh her son and you couldn't pay me enough money to sing back then. I was so, <laughs> I was so shy and cut to today, you know, um, I'm on Broadway and, and that's the cool part is, um, I didn't know that I would take such a long and far path from where I was in Manila to the Mecca of musical theater here in New York city. The podcast is over. Um, we had a great conversation just about here lies love and being a swing and what it means to be Filipino and Asian. So you know, another great time just getting to chat with Jello was amazing. And it's been a long time coming, so I'm glad we finally made it work. Um, but now I have a couple hours till I have to head out and go on the red line and on the purple bus, whatever. Um, <laughs> quite a lot of things to do. And so um, I got to go. I got to take a shower. I got to get ready. I got to pack my stuff. I got to... I don't know, do so many things. So, uh, you know, it'll be it'll be a good time just getting away for a second from Boston, um, at least central Boston. So, uh, I will keep you updated on the chaos that is probably going to ensue in the next couple hours. <laughs> with Auntie Kathy and Emma and there are the cats over there. I'll, I'll flip the camera. The cat is all the way on the couch. That's Cosmo. He's so cute. Um, but we are eating some delicious food that Auntie Kathy prepared. It looks absolutely beautiful and vibrant and I'm so excited to be spending time with the both of them. Yay! I'm gonna eat more. Yes, yes. <laughs> eat plenty. Eat so much. <laughs> That's right. Hello, Missy. 
How are you doing? And then over oh. here we've got Cosmo. <gasps> hello. Say hello. She's just staring at the camera like, what is this thing? <laughs> so cute. I love cats. Misu, you looking at the fire? Cat looking at the fire. Just enjoying the warmth, I'm guessing. Hello? <laughs> That's so funny. Hello? Oh, never mind. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I took you out of your I took you out of your comfy zone. It's alright. Okay, fine. It's okay. Say Cosmo's over there. It's all good. So we are with Misu. Misu. Say hello. Come on. <laughs> she's like, no cameras, please. That's right. Oh, well, she's used to Emma taking pictures. Face. Oh, and there's Cosmo. You want it too? No. No? Just from just from Mizu. Just two Mizu. There you go. Mizu. See? Look how pretty you are. <laughs> oh. There, 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 right there, right there. <laughs> Perfect. Perfect. Right. Perfect for the camera. <laughs> you get the right spot. Yeah. It's all good. It's all good. Well, it's getting kind of late, so I need to kind of pack up a little bit and not pack up, but just get ready for um, the weekend and, and tomorrow. So I'm going to, I'm staying over tonight at um, my auntie Kathy's house and they're so generous to let me stay here. So I get a little room to myself and a bed for um, the night, which is, is such a nice blessing. So I'm very thankful. Um, but tomorrow we're going to get some dim sum, go to the market. So I will, I'll keep you updated. I always say that. Oh my gosh, I need to find new things to say. But anyway, I had an incredible day today and I'm sure we will have an even better one tomorrow. So I will see you tomorrow.